Good morning, VC. It's Saturday morning. This is Glenn Calloway from the basement. Um, this is a contest entry for Jacob. Jacob, uh, I think, has been around the VC for a while, but he's had a name change on his channel to New Sounds and Old. Um, Jacob has like 300 and some subscribers, so uh, a lot of people know him, but if you don't, please subscribe to his channel. Jacob's a pretty cool guy, very knowledgeable about music. And uh, he's come up with an interesting concept for a contest. Um, because his channel is called New Sounds and Old, he wants us to show one relatively new record that's come out in the last year, say, and one older record, which is at least 20 years old or further back. I've chosen two interesting records, I think. So I'll start with uh, something, yeah, you know, I'll do new first. I just picked this up a couple of weeks ago. I'm a big fan of this guy. Um, I, I'm a big King Crimson fan. And this gentleman has been the lead singer and um, second guitarist to Robert Fripp. Also plays a bit of flute. Um, since about 2014, I think he joined the band. Uh, his name is Jacko Jaxic. Anybody who's into prog rock would know this name. Jacko has been a producer, an artist in his own right. Um, amazing, amazing guy, like really talented. I got an opportunity to, uh, um, the last King Crimson concert I went to, I bought a celebration pass, which allowed us access to uh, kind of behind the scenes King Crimson thing. And we got to meet Jacko Jaxic and ask him some questions and stuff. So he's a really, really nice guy. Um, but anyway, this is a solo album he just recently released, Secrets and Lies. It's a great album. The first song's quite a rocker. It's called Before I Met You. If you want to check that out on, on YouTube or Spotify or whatever you use, it's uh, I think you'd quite enjoy it. The rest of the album is kind of all over the place like most prog rock albums are. It's some some mellow stuff and some heavy stuff, and uh, but a very interesting album, and Jacko's got a great voice, lyrically interesting. Um, I suggest you check this out. Jacko Jaxic. Secrets and Lies. It also comes with a CD, too, so uh, if uh, I think I have it right here. Yes. Comes in a... So, well worth the investment. Great album. Highly recommend. Jacob, get this. Jacko Jaxic. Okay. Oh, here's the uh, vinyl. I might as well show you that, since this is the vinyl community. Nice label. I love the labels they're coming up with today. You know, it used to be the standard. It's nice to see those standard capital labels and Columbia and all that, but it's really, they, they come up with unique labels now for, uh, you know, albums. It's I, I think it uh, adds to the whole excitement of buying the record. It's a really nice sounding record too. Okay, Jacko Jacks, my old record. I just got this actually. I had it years ago on an album, it's called Fleetwood Mac in Chicago, and it was spelled out Fleetwood Mac in Chicago on the cover, and it was kind of a ready kind of cover. Um, this is the way I've got it now, Blues Jam in Chicago. This is uh, original Fleetwood Mac, 1969, Fleetwood Mac with Otis Mann, Willie Dixon, uh, who else? Uh, Shaky Horton, J.T. Brown, Guitar Buddy is Guitar Buddy Guy. Honey Boy Edwards, S.P. Leary. Man, is this a good blues album. Fantastic. It's a jam session that took place in one day at Chess Records, 1969. Peter Green at the top of his game. All these other great artists doing guest vocals and playing. and uh, Just a freaking fantastic blues album. If you're uh, into the blues... Grab this, 1969, reissued. Uh, this was uh, reissued in 2014, Sony Music, it says. Uh, Music on Vinyl is uh, who's uh, reissuing it now. Um, yeah, outstanding album. Great. So that's my two. Uh, I have subscribed to your channel, Jacob, and um, I'm going to let you know that I've uh, uploaded this video. And everybody have a great day. Peace out.